Um, the game come on my replay. Now, I always take, when you guys do replays, I always like to take screenshots of you starting up. This does slow me down when it comes to uh, doing replay uh, releases on YouTube, but I feel like it's worth it because it's kind of fun, you know? Hey, JJ! Thank you very much for the prime sub, dude. Really appreciate that, man. Oh my god, tomorrow is my birthday, and you guys are making this just such a special day. Seriously. I didn't know that I could make it all the way till 6 p.m. I got another hour to go, and I'm still feeling fine. We have a giveaway going right, Putin, for our next, uh, our next pull, our next big winner. Yep. Thank you, JJ. All right, so Trules, this is a regular, a random battle. He's got carriers to deal with. Uh, not too much in the way of destroyers, okay. Holland is well suited in this map, I think. And you said this was your best Holland game yet. So I let's see how right this now. game plays out. Okay, no problem. I somehow managed to forget to do the ticket. Ah, yes, you definitely have to do that. Get in the running. Everybody, you guys want to be in the running. You get to pick your prize, guys. I mean, what's better than that, right? You can pick any premium ship that's in the shop right now. Say there's that ship that you've always wanted to get. Now's your chance. All you gotta do, type exclamation point ticket, be a follower, be present. And if you want more chances to win, then type in exclamation point wows, create an account. You saw how easy it was. Trolls getting that last torp. Yeah, I thought so. Brown, good night to you, sir. Now, Holland has a uh, very fast reloading and very quick torpedoes, so it makes it easy to hit targets with your torpedoes. It's got guns that are eh. I feel like the guns are eh. Like, like you don't use the guns unless you absolutely have to. Um, but the torpedoes are your main bread and butter. It's got a heal, which gets you out of trouble. But, um... And it's got an engine boost too. And really strong anti-air. Sadly, you didn't take out any of the Hakuryu's planes, but um, I have a feeling we're not done with that yet. Thank you guys. Yeah, seriously, click that link, create an account. Very easy to do. Very easy to do. Any email works, any name works, any password works as long as the, the thing lets you do it. And you're good, guys. You're golden. It takes you like four and a half minutes. If you're a good player, it takes you less. If you're a bad player, it takes you a little bit more. Either way, you're playing up against five bots and you've got four bots on your team. You're gonna win this game and you can't die either. As you saw me ramming two ships and surviving. Uh, Snow Mongoose, any word if Wargaming will ever fix the islands and shores that were messed up when they added subs? Supposedly, the answer to that is yes. Um, we can report bugs. And you players also should be reporting bugs uh, when that happens. Screenshot the location, send in the replay, let the developers figure out what screwed up, and go from there. You barely shoot your guns. That's probably a good thing. Uh, okay, opening up now, I didn't... I don't feel like you checked to see who could shoot back at you, but fortunately for you, that, that Venezia just died. That's huge. That's huge. Soprador, thank you for the follow. If it takes six and a half hours, can you blame the internet connection? Rice tails, sure. The only, in my opinion, the only way it's gonna take six and a half hours to do this is if you don't have the game installed and you have to download the game because it's a massive game, as most of you know. It's like sixty gigabytes or something ridiculous. But if you already got the game, this is this is peanuts. No, Snow Mongoose, it's very different. If you report bugs on the map, more gaming listens very carefully to that. They listen very carefully to that. And I can tell you that with, with complete honesty, because I've seen Wargaming look at these uh, these map bug reports and fix certain ones. You make a mistake here in a bit, charging up to the top of the cap towards the Des Moines. Why the hell would you do that? 
first of all, kill the kill the Marceau, which I like. Good. And then get the cap. Alright, Marceau dead. Stay put right now. Stop. Get the cap, and then you can come out and play. Yep. So far, you've got three torpedo hits. Not bad. I know you want more, but you don't need more right now, right? You're up two ships. You're about to cap C. You're about to lose the Schlieffen. So, so just chill. This is the greedy win harder maneuver, but that's okay. Five more, guys. We only need five more. We'll unlock another giveaway. Should have waited till the cap. Absolutely. freaking -lutely. That's all right. You didn't. So let's see what happens. You are within radar range of the Des Moines. Now, as soon as Schlieffen goes down, if the if they discover that you that, that the cap is still ticking up, they know destroyer is in there. The Des Moines is going to radar, most likely. And look at you out in the open with your with your thing hanging out. We're gonna see the torps. Even if you if you if the Des Moines doesn't react to the cap, he should react to the torpedoes. Nice torps, by the way. The nice thing about the Holland, they don't do a lot of damage, but they can do floods, um, and they can also cause people to like freak out and like run away. You did get lucky. You did get lucky. I'm surprised he hasn't uh, radared. There it is. All right, full speed forward. Hit the hit the speed boost and get out of dodge. Oh, there we go. There's another one, guys. We only need three more to go. Come on, let's do it. You can do it. You guys can do it. If we get to 80, then th that means we get to give away. What is it? But we're on the second giveaway, right? So we get to we have to give away three more total, right? I think it's three. I believe so. Yeah. If we get to 100, it's it's even more than that. Oh my god. Some of the last damage you'll take? Well, that just activates your adrenaline rush, right? This is smart, though. At least you got behind the island. You can sit here, and you'll be fine. James Fuzzy, hello. How you doing? And thank you very much for the follow, by the way. It may have been me who made that account. Hey, no worries, Rob. Thank you very much, dude. If you had a lot of fun doing it, go make another one. Do Holland Torps have the lowest flood chance in the game? Um, I, I, I hesitate to say lowest flood chance in the game. I hate, I very much hesitate to say that. It says it tends to have the lowest risk for me. I'm sorry, can you say that again? He says it tends, seems to have the uh, yeah. most risk for me. That's true. Airdrop torpedoes like the uh, like the Issei. I would say, I would agree with you like that. Yes, Hardcastle. Co-op, training battles, any of the game modes, send them if you would like. Cthulhu, if Genshin Cthulhu is here, he can attest. I've covered many an Genshin Cthulhu replay in co-op. Oh, look at the torps. Oh, the humanity. <laughs> this is, this is, I mean, this is, this is like one of those games where you just look at it and, and you just, just start getting excited because you know, right? Like, you know it's going to be a good game. 15 torpedo hits, no floods. Now keep in mind, if their DCP is is going, is active, you won't get that either. Oh, torpedo reload time reduced. Is that the second one you've gotten already? Heal, good, there it is. Yeah, so keep that in, yeah, second, okay. So keep that in mind though. If they do have their, D, if their DCP is up, uh, you don't get the flood. So I personally, I don't keep track of how many times I'm flooding somebody. Because to me, I feel like that's just too inconsistent. So I prefer to, to keep track of how many times I hit somebody with a torpedo. And maybe you could say how many times hitting somebody with a torpedo caused them to act uh, in a way that they didn't want to act. You know what I mean? Like turn a certain way or something like that. <laughs> I mean, more torpedoes. Hello. Yeah, nobody could fire on you. Well, Des Moines could right now. Wait, DCP up will not only stop floods, but yes, exactly, Snow Mongoose. You can't even, if you're DC, okay. So if you mouse over down here, you see where it says consumable action time? During the time that the consumable is active, you cannot get flood damage 
fire, you can't, you can't get a, a flood put on you. You can't get a fire put on you. You can't lose your engine. You can't lose your rudder. You can't lose your turrets or your torpedo tubes. You are 100% invulnerable while DCP is active. That's BS. Sorry, Snowmongers. It's called balance, sir. Um, now, I mentioned that because certain ships, like, for example, American battleships, um, their invulnerability time is, is what, 20 seconds, Putin? Is that right? I believe so. And now, you could put the special module on that ex ex uh, extends that by another uh, 4 seconds to 24 seconds. Um, but that's that also explains why when carriers hit DCP, they are invulnerable for a full minute. So you'll get no torpedoes, no fire, or no flood, no fire on a carrier after they DCP, and they automatically DCP right off the bat. Third torpedo load skill. Jersey Mike is working overtime for you, sir. Uh, hard case, you put it in probably the replay analysis channel, unless it's an epic replay. Epic replays are pretty much like, check out this ridiculous game I had. I want to, you know, I want to pre or prune, preen myself or whatever, like, you know, like what a peacock does. Um, and generally speaking, I try to shy away from those replays simply because, I mean, it, it's fun to, to stroke your ego, but like this channel isn't necessarily there for that. It's more just to help people understand what they're doing right, what they're doing wrong. Um, sometimes, of course, I will point out things that they do wrong in the process of, of them doing right stuff. You try to tell the Monty to slow down. He didn't listen. Oh, well. Like playing destroyer isn't already like playing destroyer isn't already hard to do. Well, yeah, that's that's true, Snowmongers. It, it it's a challenge. Not for trolls in this game, apparently. This place is for lousy replays. Duckman, where's yours, by the way? You'd be fine with the flood being noted, then doing no damage. Hmm. Once upon a time, that's how it used to work. That's how it used to work. Not so much anymore. Solid dude, really? What's up, dude? Thank you very much for the raid, man. I love Let's Horn. Shout out there. Thank you, kitten. Someone on the analysis. There you go, Hardcore Wolf. Thank you very much. And you subscribed. I mean, I see that you are the head of our... Um, of our uh, hype train get the most recent conductor so I think that means we have to take care of one of your replays so let's do it Raiders welcome aboard I'm Lord Zeth a North American community contributor and we are doing a sponsor stream with with uh, except Raid Shadow Legends with uh, World of Warships um, we are also doing replay analysis right now and we also have a pick your prize giveaway going that I will be pulling in two minutes. Yes. Uh, oh, the replay's on the Dalian. Okay, sure. That's a great idea. I love it. Why are you conductor? Probably because you were gifted a tier one sub and therefore um, started the hype train. The most recent one. So congratulations. Lumpy Potatoes, thank you very much for the follow. Julios93, thank you as well for the follow. Appreciate it. And Nightman004, thank um, you. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> yeah, somebody gifted you one. It was probably it was probably glacial. Now right, you also cheer 25 bits, so that's kinda nice you too. Uh like us, if you're already entered, all you have to do is type exclamation point ticket in. If it says too many tickets, you're in. So if you're not sure, just type exclamation point ticket into uh, into chats, okay? That's all you gotta do, man. That's all you gotta do. And then you're good. And you're golden. As Putin said, we are currently giving away any prize. All you gotta do is go shopping on the armory page and jump in and say, hey... 
And look at that, guys. We got somebody else jumped in. We got two more to go, two more to go, two more to go, and we give away another special prize, guys. If you want to help out, type in exclamation point. Wow, is right there. There's a link in chat there. Click the link, create an account. All you got to do, all, all you got to do, this is ridiculously easy, guys. All you got to do is play one battle once you create an account. You play the one battle, and then you uh, you buy a tier two tech tree ship of whatever um, uh, whatever line you picked, whether that's Hargumo or the Hremlin or the Eerie. Pick the tier two ship, research it, exit back to port, and then you're golden, and then you're done. It takes all of five minutes or less. Oh, and, and go figure. The career stopped right when you want him to keep going. Hey, Pescador Amador, thank you very much for the follow. Getting back to our topic of the flood proccing. The problem that we had once upon a time with the flood proccing and the reason why it doesn't happen anymore for those of you guys wondering is because when it procs, it ticked one. So you had the weird situation where you get set on fire or you get flooded. Even though your DCP is active, you still get a tick of damage and you die. Which people were really frustrated with. I mean, think about how freaking annoying that is. That you think you're safe because you hit DCP and yet you still manage to die. Ouch. Art of Ross, thank you very much for the follow. Love the name. You're about to lose CV because he decided to join the match. Well, the Rikto's got secondaries, so he wants to join the match with the secondaries. Nothing wrong with that. All right. Tree Man! Thank you for the follow. My god, guys, this has been a fantastic Zafter party. We've got 50 minutes left. Puddin, we're gonna have to do a lot of giveaways very quickly, I think. Kitten, get on it! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, remember, guys, I'm keeping the same rules. I'm giving y'all a minute to make sure you're following the channel, because if you're not, when I do a follower check, which I do in chat, I'm just redrawing. As you should. Type in exclamation point ticket. Make sure you're in. If it says too many tickets, that means you're good. Nikas, thank you for the follow. <laughs> Rob, trying to flex him. What? You're not following, you jerk. That was you. What? I did. I checked your follow hitch. Oh my god, I'm not following myself. I see how it is. I don't think I can. Nice torpedoes on the Petro. That's the fourth. Fourth yeah, time you get the boost. Over almost two years now. A, a quarter of pudding. Uh, puddings. And Tony Sale, thank you for the follow. And uh, Defelion, thank you as well for the follow. Yeah, you've been following for some time, Rob. I remember some of our early replays I've done. And you've, you've improved quite a bit over time, man. It's great to see. Nostradimo, thank you for the follow. Oh, that petrol might turn into those torpedoes. Uh, he might. He might. Hakuryu, though. Hakuryu's probably dead. Hey, we got to 80! Nicely done, folks. Can we get to 100? Can we get another 20? Can we get to another 20 in 48 minutes? Guys, if we can, we'll, we'll do another giveaway where you get to pick your prize. Otherwise, Putin's gonna pick the prize list for you guys for next weekend. Q ball, thanks for the follow. Puma, thank you, man. Remember, all you gotta do is use melnesia.com if you want. And you're good, man. All right. Checking a couple things outside of the game for a sec. And stuck evergreen, thanks for the follow. Appreciate that. Not rigged except against me. James Fuzzy. James Fuzzy, are you here, sir? Puma, hey, thank you very much. And please, you don't ever need to spend money on this channel. Ever, 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 ever. So, if you're willing to put a little time in, like, I, I mean, Puma, that, that means so much. Seriously, it really does. So, thank you, man. Cheers, dude. Thank you. James Fuzzy is here. 
All right, Puddin should get in touch with you shortly. You get to go shopping, my dude. Get to go shopping. Um, been here for 15 minutes, right? Seriously, he's here for 15 minutes and he gets to go shopping. Ridiculous.